hello guys you're welcome once again to today's video so this is an update that i want to give to you this is a quick one this information was shared by doctor he's in the uk army and if you want more details about the uk army application visa application and stuff you can follow him so at the end of this video i will mention his handle so this is information that um, doctor has given and it is very important for you to also listen to this so that is why i'm sharing this information without wasting much of your time let's listen to this important information from doctor army and you are waiting for the army to get back to you please kindly um, listen to this video and share this video most people have been refused their visitors visa application to join the british army or to come for the assessment because the home office on their refusal letters write or states that one some people do not have military experience which i particularly see to be like flimsy excuse but in the knowledge of the home office they have a reason why they probably say that you need to have the military experience for you to meet the visa requirement with that one thing that you can do is that you need to prove to them that yes indeed you have a military experience hence your interest in joining the british army one of the ways you can do is that if you have ever been in a cadet back in school high school university uh, or whatever please get your pictures done get some pictures printed out or scan your pictures and support and uh, use it to support your application if you live in a, in a military environment yes prove to it if you have worked in a military environment if you're a civilian and you've worked in a military environment it's a military experience hence you have the interest to join the british army that is a simple way that is today he was refused um on, on that particular reason hence we needed to prove that yes he has been in the cadet he has worked in the military environment hence his interest in joining the british army moreover another reason why they do normally refuse people is the fact that they keep saying that on the invitation letter the army states that you need to be in the uk four weeks prior to your assessment and uh, most people because are not ready or are not prepared or they are not expecting that the invitation may come as soon as possible they tend to wait till the assessment comes and when they they receive the assessment letter or invitation letter they start fumbling they start going around looking for a document to support your document uh, your visa application so one of the ways you could do is uh, get your documents ready i've been doing lots of videos about how to prepare um, for your visa application to come to the uk go watch those videos get your documents down get your document ready when you get the document as soon as you receive the invitation letter please do not waste time on it put in your application remember it normally takes you about 21 working days to get a decision from the home office which approximately takes about a month so if you receive your invitation letter mostly it's about two months ahead so if you delay within that window and you put in the application the home office will emphasize on the military or the army stating that you need to be in the uk four weeks prior to it but sometimes people get their visas approved but most of the times people get refused with these two um, reasons please kindly share this video all right so this is the information that i want to share with you guys so you can follow him on youtube here okay achieve underscore underscore achieve underscore doctor or on tiktok doctor thank you for watching this video let's see you